How come you guys haven't lost any GoPros yet? <laughs> We're waiting for something cool to happen. You done jumping? Yeah, I think we are. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.
So here's a quick wrap up of the dive. Um, found about, I don't know, a couple dollars and change, some trash. And the knife I thought was pretty neat until I inspected it a little further. It's uh, beyond repair. It might have been interesting at one time. A couple of rings. This one's kind of chintzy. Homemade job, I imagine. But this one seems a little bit nicer. I think that's a tiger eye. And it's such a small wire, I doubt there's any markings indicating whether it's silver or not. But that does look like a tiger eye to me. And a decent stone. And it's made fairly well. It's pretty, pretty durable little ring. The cool finds are these rocks, believe it or not. The painted rocks. I went to the, this uh, Facebook page. It says, Ohio Rocks Rule. Find us on Facebook. Post a pic and rehide me. Hashtag KS Campers. And I did, and, and both of these stones had that same message on them. Uh, Ohio Rocks Rule, uh, find us on Facebook, and I did, and I found the person who actually painted these and hid them. They hid them on shore, and I found them in the lake, so someone must have just, you know, took them and tossed them in the lake. I think it's kind of a neat thing. Um, go ahead and um, check them out. I'll leave a link at the bottom as well uh, in the description down below. You can find them and then uh, see what they're doing. It seems to be a pretty popular thing. They're starting to do that up here quite a bit too. There's a couple of sites or uh, Facebook pages uh, dedicated to hiding and painting stones. Interesting stuff. Thanks for watching guys. As always, dive safe.